Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Jenny and I hope you are having a wonderful Tuesday. First off, I want to say thank you to all of you for all the wonderful birthday wishes. Today was a fun, relaxing day. My husband took the day off. He took me to my favorite antique store where we spent a couple hours walking around in there. I found some really cute items. We also went to a couple other stores and lunch. So it was really fun. Um, it's, it's crazy when the older you get, the more easy you are to please on, you know, doing something for your birthday. So that made me really happy to spend some quality time with my husband. And when I went to the Dollar Trees, I had to record so that I was able to show you what is new and what to look out for. So many amazing cute items and some new Jot products as well. So with all that said, I hope you all enjoy these trips. Okay, so they have this tablet stand. This one feels a little bit better than the one they had last year. And it is by Jot. Jot, you rock. So I think that was really nice. And look at these. These are push pens and they're velvet. Push pens, that is. And you get 20 per pack. So they have that deep navy and this taupe color. How cool are those? And look at these pencil containers. They are plastic, but they have all these little foam balls in there. I don't know if you can maybe change it out with something else. I'm not sure. But they did have it in four colors. You have it in the blue, pink, purple, and what do you want to call that? Like a mint green color. Here they have a container that is adjustable. Well, it expands, that is. It's in black and white. Here, let me pull it apart. There you go. And another Dollar Tree, I'm going to show you even a bigger one. So there it is together and then pulled apart. But how cool are those? And they also have these card holders. Well, I'm sure you can use them for other things if you want to. And then they have this pencil tower. Again, at another Dollar Tree, I'm going to show you a couple of other items that go with this collection. So yeah, it's pretty cool the black and white plaid they have these baskets again this year these are always really nice to have around your house or make up little goodie baskets for gifts they have it in the pink gray and that mint green they also have it in this size and it's by it says storage essentials and they also have these bendable ones i think that's what they call them yeah. So you can see how they bend in that. So those are cool. For all those Stitch fans, look what I found. These are by Disney. They have five different Stitch figurines. How adorable. My daughter, Ava, she loves Stitch. These are so cute. Believe it or not, I've never watched Lilo and Stitch. Or is it Stitch and Lilo? Lilo and Stitch. I think that's what it is. Not quite sure. I've never watched it before, but my daughter likes it. But I think these are so cute. Again, a name brand item. Perfect gifts for Christmas or cake toppers. So if you see any of these characters that your little ones like, perfect cake toppers. That's what I'm doing with mine. Little Pluto. Oh, my dog just tooted. I don't know if you heard that or not. <laughs> Ruby. They have some new puzzles by Nickelodeon. And they have this Jurassic Park. It's a 24 piece. They also have the Paw Patrol. Friendship Fun. And then, I don't know. I think it's that melon. Is it Coco Melon or something? Yeah, Coco Melon. A 12-piece. 12 12-piece? 12 did I read that right? I think I did. And there's a 24-piece. These are ages 5 and up. And Peppa Pig. Look at this. The Roadrunner and Wile E. Coyote. I always look to see how long these movies are. This one was only 39 minutes. I don't think it was worth $1.25, so I put it back. 
Here they have some fashion gems and pink hearts. And it does come with the glue. I'm trying to twist it around here to see what you put it on. So yeah, I guess a bunch of different surfaces that you can put those on. Over here by the Christmas items, they are getting more of the ornaments out. They have the snowman with that color of hat. And then they also have it with the black and red. I always love these little elf legs. They have it in that color and that one up there. There's a two pack of birds and then you have the red birds here. There's some tree toppers. They have it in the gold and silver. Here are the little church ornaments, which you can um, cut the back out if you want to. And you can put one of the fake tea lights in there and then your church will light up. So you just like cut some of that off and stick your tea light in there and it'll light up. Just a thought. I think those are cute. If you have like a little village that you make up, those would be cute. There's a wooden sign that says Noel. That's Ava's middle name since she was born right before Christmas. And they also have it in the word snow with the black and white. And they have it in hope with the black and white. There's these deer. I think I showed you those in my last walkthrough. I'm not 100% sure. They have these again this year. I mean, some of these are really, really nice, and others are just, eh, you know, they're okay. But I really like these. Again, these are real easy to make over. So if you like to add your grandkids' names or a different saying, your pets' names, you can put their little paw prints on there. I think those would be really cute. There's a little wooden door. I bought one of these last year and I took the knob off because I didn't like the gem. Let it snow. The uh, snowman. There's some larger presents in the black and white. And they also have it in the red and black back there. With the burlap. The weird looking owls. Oh, here's the Merry Christmas with Santa. Oh, this one's new. Look at there. Season greetings with the gnome. I really like these, but I just, it doesn't go with my theme. But I think those are so cute. And they have these ornaments again this year. I did multiple DIYs with these before, but I really like those. I take the deer off and do other things with them. So just keep that in mind when you buy stuff. Just know that you can dissect things and make your own oh what's back here well hello mary and believe and peace these are one of my favorite christmas ornaments from the dollar tree they're light up icicles and they do come with the batteries each one takes three and a lot of Christmas bulbs. And believe it or not, they go quick. Christmas bells, very glittery. I just don't understand why everything has to have so much glitter. Well, there's some with that glitter. And some with gold and silver. Silver bells. So, oh, and these deer right here, well, not the snowflake, but those seem pretty nice. But these deer, I really like these deer, but the quality this year, eh, not looking too sharp there. Here's some of the foam sheets. You get 12 per pack. These are by Crafter Square. They have the gingerbread. You can always add your own pictures on there. You can put messages on there. You can hang them from your tree, tape them to your wall, hang them from your ceiling. 
you got the white snowflake, the blue snowflake, and you have the white angels. So if you have any loved ones up in heaven, you can put their names or pictures on there. Here's some craft kits. You can make five per pack. So you got the Santas, you have the snowman, the gingerbread man. That one was my favorite one. And then they have these stocking kits. You make three per pack and they give you everything you need besides the glue. So just make sure you have glue. And then they have this pack. And this one. Oh, and a penguin. Make five penguins. There's some more items that you can paint. You get three pink colors and a paint brush. These are ages eight and up. They also have these tote bags. They come with four markers, a few different ones to choose from. There's the gnome one. Oh, and they have that little paint set right there. All their little wood pieces. There's the bells, which those are really cute to hang on your tree. Again, you can put little messages on there, write people's names or initials. Here's some more little felt items that you can purchase by Crafter Square. There's the snowman. You get 12 per pack. And you got the stockings, which it looks like you can poke those out, I'm assuming. They have some new canvas art by Special Moments. These look just like boho decor. Which these would go really well with all that. Um, the boho stuff I showed you in my last walkthrough. I'll be sure to link that down below if you missed it. But I think these are absolutely gorgeous. Like I've stated before, you can always take the canvas off of these wood frames and cut them into different pieces and shapes and Mod Podge them or glue them, tape them, whatever, onto other items. I just really love the colors. They have a new plate this year. Home Sweet Gnome. Very cute. Well painted. And then the other ones they had, they had last year. So nothing too exciting under there. Oh, and they found the uh, Christmas trees. Which you can see, you can poke little things out. So what, what are you supposed to do when you poke it out? I don't, I don't know. Here's a couple other items with the black and white plaid. This is the pencil holder. They are plastic. Kind of flimsy. But here's a bigger one. Of the tray that ex extends. Can't do with one hand, so. And that's what that one looks like. So you can kind of see the difference. Here's some new pens. You got a donut, you got a hamburger, and a piece of pizza. They have some new mugs for the holidays. Hot cocoa served here. That one's really cute. They do have the print on both sides. Nice until proven naughty. I am only a morning person on December 25th. And yes, that is true. And happy holidays. Yeah, these ornaments, which I think you can just buy a cord or cut up a cardboard box and do your own thing. That's pretty much what they did with these. So I honestly don't think they're worth a dollar twenty-five. Just my honest opinion. They have a lot of their floral out, but I really, really love these branches. I think they had these a couple of years ago, for actually for the past couple of years, and I have done some DIYs with those. 
but these are really cute. Oh, Ruby. She just tooted again. Oh, my goodness, girl. You gotta love the Boston Terriers and Frenchies. Oh, gosh. Love the berries. Those are nice. And I like the ones with the little red berry. Yeah, those right there. Those are really cute. A little bit of sparkle, but not overwhelming of sparkle. I just wish they wouldn't put glitter on everything. Ugh. I don't know. Maybe it's something they can work on. Let me know if the glitter bugs you guys at all. Or, I don't know. Maybe it's just me. I don't know. Yeah. Lots and lots of Christmas foliage. A lot of poinsettias. They have some new colors this year. Here you get a five pack of these cedar picks. 14 inch by 3 inch. They have it in the white and gold and the red. I'm sure they're supposed to have silver and green. And they maybe just didn't put them out yet, but that's my guess. Here they have these. They have little metal clips there on the bottom. And again, you can always dissect these and use them elsewhere on things. Clip them in your tree, put them on gifts. We also have this one. Those are some big old berries. Those I would say are probably about the size of a seedless grape. I think that's what I'll go with today. Oh my gosh, if my dog's toots one more time. Ruby, do you have to go potty? Sorry. Oh, I found some Heidi gnomes back here. A couple of different ones. So they have, they look extra plump this year. But why is its arm flung up like a fin? And they also have these picks, the Christmas bulbs and the pine cones. We got a gold one back here. Not too bad. Just got to fluff it out a little bit and fix it up. So they're a little smooshed. Oh, and they have these as well. I think you can put those around candles, I think. Or like candle holders or something. And they also have it in the white. And they call it a mini wreath. And here we have some Arm & Hammer body wash. On scented. Okay, well, that's the end of our Dollar Tree trips. I sure hope you enjoyed it and you're able to find some goodies too. Jot down onto your wish list. If you want, why don't you go ahead and comment down below and let me know if you've seen something in hopes that you can find at one of your local Dollar Trees. If you enjoyed this video, I would love a thumbs up. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, I would really love to have you. If you would like to follow me on Instagram or TikTok, I'll link that down below. As always, I want to say thank you for always taking the time out of your day to stop and watch my videos. So I hope you all have a wonderful, beautiful, safe Tuesday. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys. Keep smiling. Come here, Joe. Hi, Chip. Josie, come here. It's okay, Chip. You causing problems over there? Huh? Huh? Are you being the bee? Huh? What do you guys say for yourself? Hmm? You ready to go in?
and be a nice girl. Huh? No. Your sister is waiting for you. Ruby. Oh, no. No, you... Oh, you little turd. Go on. No, uh -uh. Don't you do it. Don't you throw a fit. I didn't want to embarrass you. I didn't, but you weren't listening to me. So I'm sorry. I had to go out there and pick you up in front of your friend. But you know, Mommy do love you, even though you're a little stubborn little brat. And I think everyone knows that by now. But they love you. Uh oh, you gonna go there and get a toy? What one are you gonna get? You gonna cry because you can't get over there? Do you need Mommy's help? Hmm? Hmm? You're not going back out there. I'm not walking way over there to grab you again. Nope. You're done. You're done. Nope. Don't stop scratching at my door. You see that? That's all Josie. There's hardly any door left. See? You did it again. I'm going to put mittens on you. You want to wear some mittens? I'll buy you some mittens. What do you guys say? Hmm? Watching your sister out there? Yeah? She's out there all alone. And you can't tell her where to pee. And you don't like that, do you? Oh, I can see it in your eyes. You are not happy. But I am not going out there after you. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Are you done being mad at me? No? Okay. Are you going to go pick on your sister? Don't give her that look. What do you want? Hmm? Mommy's got to eat something. It's almost bedtime. I'm hungry. You already ate. Mommy already feed you your dinner. And you got all your medicines. Yes, you did. You're good to go until tomorrow morning. And it will get you medicine. medicine too tomorrow okay you only get it in the morning okay you only get it in the morning and then you get your tree and then I read the news and then we eat breakfast don't we yes mommy feeds you your, your breakfast and then I take your sister on her car ride every morning and then I come home, and what happens? You get a cookie. Oh, you know that word. Yes, you get a cookie. I get a cookie. Oh, not now, Boo Bear. Sorry. Oh, she thinks she gets a cookie now. Okay. Said a little too much.